Hey everyone, Wonderbot here, and welcome to XCOM UFO Defense, or in this case, Open XCOM. So, as a, uh, as a Patreon, uh, sponsored game, I was asked to play the original XCOM. The original original, not Enemy Unknown. Uh, and I was looking at it, and I was trying to get it working, and it didn't work. And eventually I was like, alright, let's, uh, let's see if anything is, uh, anything works. And apparently, uh, people have been remaking it, more or less, as Open XCOM, and this is the 1.0 version. Uh, so it has some extra functionality. I think the AI is a little bit better. Uh, we'll see. I think they fixed some of the other bugs. But, uh, more so than anything else, it supports custom re resolutions. Which, I mean, despite the fact that this game is a pixelated mess, uh, still works in my favor. So, uh, the other thing I should probably mention is that this game, this this video was sponsored by uh, Omni Negro from my uh, Twitch, Twitch chat. Yeah, you heard me. And so, uh, I guess... Thanks, Omni, for asking me to play this game, because, you know, I loved Enemy Within, un at Unknown and Within, and, you know, we've got XCOM 2 coming up. Let's give this one a shot and see how it goes. I'm probably going to die very fast, so we're going to be on Beginner. Uh, I'll leave, I'll leave off Iron Man. I'm pretty bad at these things. Okay, select a site for a new base. Can I, like, oh, hello. Fucking, we're Santa Claus. Base name. Um... Oops. I... We're gonna call it Santa's shop. We're on the North Pole. <laughs> yeah, okay, I did actually hit the right one. Okay, so bases. What can we do? Build new base. Base information. Uh, funds. Arctic. Uh, yeah. What am I doing here? What is... Okay, soldiers. We got a bunch of rookie dudes. Okay, base information. Awesome. Personal available total. 1010. Space used. Monthly costs. Uh, equip craft. Build facilities. Okay, living quarters. Laboratory. Workshop. Small radar system. Large radar system. Missile defenses. General stores. Alien containment. And hangar. Let's try a... Uh, what are these things? Come to think of it. So, facility in use. So, living quarters, laboratory, general stores, access lift, small radar system, and workshop. We've also got th uh, two interceptors and the Sky Ranger. Sky Ranger is for getting around, I assume. So, let's take a look at research. What can we get? We have new project. Laser weapons, motion scanner, medikit. Uh, let's go with a medikit for the time being. Okay, scientists allotted. Start project. Okay, laser weapons. The other five. Start project. Okay. So those will get worked on, presumably. Manufacture. What can we make? New production. Alright, we can make nothing. Let's see. Purchase and recruit. So we can get a lot of junk. Um. <sighs> I'm trying to figure out exactly what all of these things mean, and unfortunately... I'm coming up with a bit of a no. We can get more scientists. We can get more engineers. Okay, that's cool. Cost per unit. How much money do I have? Lots. Obviously, spending it flagrantly is probably going to be a bad deal. Okay, pistol, rifle, rifle clip, heavy cannon, auto cannon. See, the problem is I don't know which ones of these are specifically um, for ships and which ones aren't. So why don't we go back for a second? Why don't we do soldiers, Andrea Costa, armor nun, craft Sky Ranger, rookie. So we need armor. We can sack no. What kind of how do we know what weapons people have? Maybe we haven't bought. Maybe do you know what? Let's just assume we have nothing. So we've got eight soldiers. So. Let's buy armor. Where Where is armor? I saw this earlier. Rocket, rifle, tank cannon. Seriously, do we not have armor here? I swear I saw armor. Auto cannon, rocket launcher, grenade, proximity. Yeah, nothing. Okay. We've also got special ammo. 
Oh, maybe we do actually have more than one. Okay, so why don't we go back for a second? Why don't we do save game? New save game. Uh, na name? I don't know. Uh, we're gonna name this one. Uh, ho 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 gonna die. There we go. All right, save game. Uh, so what do we? What are we even doing here? Five seconds. One minute. Oh, that's that's for like speeding up time and stuff. I got it now. Graphs. North America. This is. All right, how do we go back? I don't know. Uh, there we go. Funding. Okay. So this is this is our funds, presumably per month. Bases. Base base information. I'm just flipping through all of this because I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm going into this completely blind. I probably should have like watched somebody else's playthrough, but I feel like it. I don't know. Just maybe it doesn't bankrupt the process, but still, quick craft. Let's see, so Sky Ranger has nothing. These are good. Okay. Huh. So what can we do here? Missile defenses might not be a bad idea. Or alien containment right here? 18 days maintenance is expensive, though. Maybe not. Maybe not immediately, because we've got all the basics, I think. All right, you know what? Let's not spend any money. I've yet to determine on whether or not even I'm even going to be able to play more than a couple rounds of this before everybody dies. Uh, let's see. Either way, yeah. Soldiers, until we can figure out how to give them proper armor, I think we're just on our own. Okay. Well, this is going to be this is going to be fabulous. How do we get out of here? Geoscape. There we go. Okay. Oh, interesting. If I right-click on the globe, it switches to this. Also, this uh, this game, just to make mention, was made by Micropose, which was my favorite uh, game company growing up. Okay, here we go. Um, small UFO detected. Size small. Altitude very high. Yes. Intercept. Let's send out our... Oh. We can actually zoom in on this. What's going on? I honestly am having trouble finding out here. Interceptor. Okay. How do we know what's going on here? UFO. Very high speed. Intercept. I'm gonna send multiple. Are we shooting at it? How do we... Do we just let this happen? Okay, there we go. Standoff. What's going on? What is? What do? Standard attack. Standoff. Cautious attack. Aggressive attack. Aggressive attack. Okay, what's the button? UFO crash lands. Alright, I've succeeded at crashing the UFO. Beauteous. I assume they go back now. Crash light one. Okay, small ground. Uh, intercept. Sky Ranger. Target crash light one. Yes. I am um, understanding things. Maybe. Watch all my guys just not have guns or anything. That is very possible here. So I'm liking the fact that it's uh effectively a giant globe with like locations and stuff. I assume I can do nothing to. Moscow or Novosibirsk. That surprises me in no way, shape, or form. Well, either way, let's see how this goes. It's probably going to be a complete mess, but you never know. Maybe, maybe we'll be okay. Maybe we won't just go kablooey. Okay, I'm not entirely sure yet. All right. You know I can speed this up, can't I? There we go. Okay, ready to enter, ready, ready to land near, crash site one, begin mission. Yes! Okay, uh, exercise caution, there may be operatives in the UFO around the crash site. Mission will be successful when all the enemy units have been eliminated or neutralized. Recovery of UFOs, remains, alien artifacts, and corpses can be initiated. To abort the mission, return XCOM operatives to transport vehicle and click the abort mission icon. Okay, so we've got... Andrea Costa, G. Genji, Giovanni. Okay, so it looks like everybody at least has weapons. 
Now, we do have a couple of things remaining. How many characters? It was Andrea Costa was the main one. Okay, so we've got two pistols with some ammo. What's this? Extra ammo. That's a grenade. So. Oh, I see. You can over-encumber him. Does anybody have any remaining space? Yes. So you have extra ammo. You're pretty much weighted down. You don't have much. You don't have much. And you might as well have that. Okay. So what is this exactly? Ammo rounds left. I don't even... Oh, H-C-H-E ammo. I don't actually know if we can even use that. What's this do? I don't know. I don't know anything. What's these buttons do? Okay, that means nothing. Okay, open XCOM. Turn 1. Side XCOM. Press button to continue. Okay, so we can zoom out. How do we rotate? Can't... Eh. How do we rotate camera? Uh, move unit level above. View level below. Center. Don't reselect. Select ne next unit. Multi-level view. Options. Abort mission. And turn. Kneel. Mini mini map. Okay, that's useless. What's this? Reserve snapshot. Uh, unit stats. Reserve TVs for kneeling. Oh, TV. It's probably not TVs. It's probably TUs. Alright, so it doesn't look like I can rotate the camera, which makes sense. This isn't a 3D game. How much is this? Unit stats? No, what are these? Okay, energy. Time units. There we go. Okay, so that's the one that's getting depleted, and energy is other stuff. Okay. So time units is top. Let's just run, over, run them over here. Not enough time units. Okay, so how do we end turn? End turn. Hidden movement. XCOM. Oh, do I... Oh, I select all of my different characters. I got it. The way these characters just jitter around is honestly kind of funny. Alright, so it looks like this is a nearly linear map. Which is interesting. Weird. It doesn't look like there's a particularly in-depth cover system either. Unfortunately, I get the very distinct feeling that everybody is going to die here. Which I feel bad about. But it does not seem like the sort of thing that I'm going to do particularly well at. I don't know, the last time I played XCOM, I got my ass kicked real hard. Then again, we're on the absolute minimum difficulty, so we'll see. I don't know. Uh, let's see, I have saves coming on, which is normally a an option that's turned off uh, for open XCOM. So technically what I can start doing is like loading, reloading as we go along. But that's not a high priority for me. Yeah. I So, I'm going to say this now. Apart from the god-awful user interface, I'm actually liking bits of this. There are definitely elements that I, I am not opposed to. One of the things that I always, uh, always hated about the XCOM game... Oops. Not enough timing units. Okay. Well, we found the aliens. They're uh, shooting at me. All right, is there Overwatch? Snapshot, auto shot, aim shot. Spend all time units reserved for aim shots. Kneeling. Okay. Yeah, I don't know if there's cover in this game. I don't... No! Well, whatever. Honestly, I think after this one, I'm probably going to have to do some research on how to play. And then I'm going to have to... Oh. 
then I'm gonna have to do something or other. I don't entirely know. I'm still trying to figure out where these aliens are. Honestly. Okay. So I thought it was a linear map, but no, that's just the way line of sight works. Game, which is a little bit silly. You'd think you'd have like a general, like idea of what the map looks like before you get in. Like I always like that about, you know, the original XCOM. So it's usually pretty damn obvious. Maybe not where the enemies were. Stuff. Oh, time units reserved for snapshot. Okay. I have no idea what the difference is between snapshot and other shot. My tree. We're getting beshooted at. Alright, cool. Still don't know where they are. You. Get on top of this mountain. Tell me where shit is. There's nothing here. Great googly moogly, we're gonna die. Center on enemy. We have an enemy. Uh, can I shoot him? How do we, how do we shoot? How do we... Aim, shoot. Center on enemy. How, options. Options. Nope. Cancel. Have him kneel. Okay. So we've got one alien over there. And we want to reserved TPs for Okay, time units reserved for auto shot. Hopefully they just shoot at the end of their turn. Okay, center on enemy two. What the? What? Enemy one, enemy two. Where's enemy one? Oh, he's up there on that hill. Okay. This is not working out as great as I want. Okay. I assume he's going for the right one. Okay. Wait, what? No. Mm -hmm. How do you switch characters now? Move unit, inventory, kneel? Nope. Select next unit. Okay, there we go. That's what we're going for. Can you not move anymore? Well, let's see if we, uh, let's see if we actually manage to even kill one alien this entire fight. Okay, uh, select next unit. Next unit, next unit, next unit. Next unit, next, there we go. Go as far as you can, Mira Kamar. I believe in you. Okay, so let's see if we start shooting. Allies. No. Oh, it does look like we have shot. However, Mira Kamar and Giovanni Man Manschini have died. All right, we have killed an alien. He is dead now. Congratulations, I have murdered one alien and lost three people. Fantabulous. Alright, uh, let's go with let's go with auto shot. I don't really know what the difference is between the two of these. Okay, time units reserved for auto shot. I am running out of units. This surprises me in no way, shape, or form. Just go as far as you can. I can just kill a couple of these. Okay, end turn. Oh shit, I forgot about that person on the hill. Well... He's panicked, but he dodges the shot. Grab your gun. None of time units. Uh... We didn't shoot, did we? I'm just gonna say this right now. I don't know how to attack enemies. I think that's kind of the main issue. Uh...
Oh. Oh. Fuck. <laughs> so now we know. Now we know how to automatically shoot at enemies. Whoops. Well, this has gone great. Uh, so that's how shooting works. Not enough time units. Um. Can I pick up that gun? How do we pick up gun? Oh, ground. Here we go. Re-equip his weapons. Okay, now... We want to aim shot at... He can't see it. Goody. Alright, let's... Move forward a little bit. Uh, let's save for aimed shot instead of auto shot. I can't even see it anymore. Not enough time units. Does he have enough to hit anything? Not enough time units. Okay. Cool. You, on the other hand. Where'd this alien go? Ah, yeah, there's another one. Well, this is bad. Wait, we can see him. Alright, uh, throw. Yes, no. Alright, the alien is dead. Congratulations. We have at least three aliens remaining. Four. This has only gone poorly. This has only gone... From worse to still worse. Alright. Well, let's keep shooting. Alright. Congrats. I've killed another one. Aim shot. Do we have any other aliens? No. Okay. Don't reserve time units. Let's just go up here. Out of time units. Okay. You. You. How many time units do you have left? Some amount! Unfortunately, we know we don't know where any more aliens are. This is going to go poorly. We are surrounded. They're all over. Okay. Perfect. We actually have a gun! We can shoot. Got it! I won! Yeah! We lost so many people. <laughs> I may I got 27 points. <laughs> wow, that was incredibly bad. Um I you know what? I think I'm going to say this now with a casualty uh with a survival rate of 25%, that's better than how I normally do uh <laughs> uh 9 times out of 10. I don't even know. That was bad. Maybe? I don't know if that was bad or not. I'm definitely going to have to do some research before I try again. So I think I, I will I will try one at, at least once more. Uh, it's interesting nonetheless. Yeah, I, I think I will try. And you know what? I might actually uh, try, try doing this on stream. Usually I do the first Patreon videos off stream just because they always end in abject failure. Um, but yeah, why, why don't we do that? So I will see you guys on the next episode of Open XCOM where... Uh, everybody will die yet again because no matter how much I learn about these things the uh, brave soldiers of Santa's workshop will never ever manage to repel the alien menace and that's how XCOM 2 happens because duh <laughs> I'll see you guys then thanks for watching